Well, you may be losing money right out the roof through this gas vent valve. Today we're going to be talking about gas valves proving as well as the vent valve on the boiling point. Welcome to The Boiling Point. I'm here today with Michael Taylor, a resident expert, and we're going to be talking a little bit about gas valve proving as well as venting the gas valve. Now, Michael's got John Deere. I'm not sure if we're doing John Deere boilers or not now, but uh, you're just going to represent the tractors, right? Why not? Avid tractor, man. How many tractors do you own? 135. 135. Retirement. So if you need a tractor, <laughs> give me a call. All right, Mike, what we got? We got some gas valve proving. What, what do we got here? Well, gas valve proving is a, is a new system that's relatively new, been out for a couple of years for, for testing your gas valves every time the boiler cycles. Okay. And this system here is an auto flame system that it actually, the sensor right here goes between the two gas valves and your vent valve and every time the boiler shuts off, it tests the valves to make sure nothing's leaking. But what also comes along with it is that you can actually, if you have this sensor, you can get rid of your vent valve mm. and not even have to have it. Okay. One of the problems with a vent valve is that if you don't have this valve proving, the vent valve can start leaking and nobody knows it because it's supposed to be closed when the boiler is running. If it's leaking through, then it's just dumping gas out the roof the whole time the boiler is running and nobody knows what's going on. What, why don't we define what this vent valve or vent is supposed to do for the gas? What it was there for, its whole intent and purpose was to vent gas out between the valves when the boiler is in the off cycle, just in case your valves are leaking through. It doesn't fill the boiler up. Okay. It will vent it out. And, and it's always worked good for that purpose, but the problem is if it starts leaking, then when your boiler is running, it's dumping gas out. Is this, you think this is maybe a common problem in some boiler rooms where um, you might have some leaking and they, they wouldn't even know it. Right. right? The, uh, oh yeah, we've, we've found numerous ones. We just found this one about a month ago was leaking. Okay. And uh, when we turned the valve proving system on it. It caught it. It caught it. Yeah. Now I noticed we have Honeywell gas valves here, but when you're getting into some water tube stuff, what, what are we using? What do, we, what do you use in that situation? Then you get into bigger valves and higher pressure more than Honeywell can, can provide. So, so then we'll, we'll use either Maxon or Siemens gas valves that, that are rated for a lot higher pressure. Something's unique though with the Siemens valve. What do they do with their valves? They put two valves in one body. Okay. So you have less piping, easier to put in and take out. Okay. Uh, so that's the, and they also have a valve proving system that's built into that. Now they have a vent as well? Yes. Okay. Okay. Um, all right. Well, so is, what else with the auto flame, that, what does it do, the gas valve proving? Well, not only the gas valve proving, but that sensor also takes place of your high and low gas pressure switches. Mm. So it's, it's UL listed to, to take care of the, all the safeties on the gas train. Okay. Uh, high and low gas and prove that your valves are not leaking. All right, good. Good information. All right, well make sure that you're checking your gas vent valve that it is not leaking gas out into the atmosphere which is costing you the change. So always uh, good hanging with you Mike and we'll see you next time on The Boiling Point. Well, I love to hear the rumble of a boiler and we're firing this one up and having it running and you might be firing yours up too as the winter is drawing closer. Make sure you check that vent valve. Well, like us on Facebook, follow us on Twitter. If you don't mind, maybe subscribe to the YouTube channel or share a video. And we'll see you next time on The Boiling Point.